Maupuza, unga puze lohama lengili. That's the law. So if you want to repent, you stop doing it, you drink in your house. That's the law. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Skuluma nye repentance, Anish. I'm giving a simple example. Ukuluma nye repent, Anish. Oh, if you are repent, I'm sure umjata yungu nungu lufano kia eloguti. If you want to change, ufano wen the soul. Hayo kutuwa enos kia eloguti mwenza. Na yungu nungu lufano kia eloguti the way to do it. Topic 4, verse 15. Wait, wait. No, I'm going to give you the answer. Now I'm going to have a simple example. Because, la la, wait, 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 wait. Wait. But the way you come to him, you don't come to him without using his book. His book tells you how to change. Now I'm going to show you how to do it. Read it. Topic 415. Yeah, but listen. This is how you know him. Listen good, listen good. The book of Torah, chapter 4, 15. Listen. Go ahead. Do that to no man which thou hate. Go ahead. Drink not wine to make thee drunk. I did don't drink wine to get drunk. But my oh wait, wait. Go ahead. Neither let drunkenness go with thee in thy church. At my pooza. Don't be going around the petty boys and humble strategy. God don't say don't drink. He says when you drink, sit down, drink in your house. Don't be tra traveling around the petty boys and you're gonna be hit by cars. The Lord says don't do that. God don't say doesn't drink. He didn't say don't drink. He says, but when you drink, challenge in order, be dignified, sit in the house, drink properly. It's very simple. Now, you said you have more questions. Yes, next question. Yes. Right. Which question? Ask the question. Yes. Yeah, let's read John 4. Because I know you're still stuck on that because you know that Christianity, broken mixtape, it just keeps running. I know the mixtape, the broken mixtape of Christianity keep running, so we need to go there to break the record even more so we can give you a new one. Now read it. The book of John chapter 4, 24. Watch this. God is a spirit. God is a what? God is a spirit. So God is a spirit. Come on. And they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Now, so does it mean or God does not have a body? No, 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 no. I'm asking you a question. Does it mean that God doesn't have a body now? Is that what it's saying? No, it but doesn't mean that. It doesn't mean I God does know. not have a body. I don't know how God, God has a like, body. But what I know, every time when I see, I see something good, that's... God has a body. Don't you get that? You don't believe it. But why do they say God is spirit? I understand. Jesus Christ. What is the spirit? It says, what is that? Well, but what do what you say? A young child cannot understand what you're saying. When you say more, yeah, you don't even understand what you should say. When you say more, what you mean? No, but what does it mean? When you say more, what do you mean? No, what is it? What is the Holy Spirit? Actually, let me let me break it easy. Yes, yes. Do it. The 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 spirit of which is that one. Yeah, but what is it? Yeah, but what is it? What is that spirit? Let me show you what the spirit is. Give me John 63. Hold it. I'm going to show you what the spirit is, man. Because in the Christian church, they like to say these things, but they never explain them. Wait, wait, wait. Before we get to my tattoo, I'm going to explain this first. Because I know that's where Christians run to. You can't make this up, man. Hold on, my brother. John 6, 63, you see? <laughs> Read the Bible. The book of John, chapter 6, verse 63. Here we are going to explain what the Spirit is, first and foremost. It is the Spirit that quickens. It is the Spirit that quickens, my brother. Pay attention, you ask the question. Read the Bible again. The book of John, chapter 6, verse 63. Come on. It is the spirit that quick. It is the spirit that quicken it. Come on. The flesh profiteth nothing. Read the word. The what? The word. The what? The word. Come on. That I speak unto you. Read 
they are spirit. They are what? They are spirit. Right. And they are like. So you know what the spirit is? The spirit is the word of God. That's it. The spirit is the word of God. What is the word of God? The laws of God. That's it. That's it. The spirit of God is the laws of God. That's it. So when you say Umoya, yeah, you talk about the laws of God. Yes. Yes. We do what? We have a school. We have a school where you come and learn, my brother. It's down, the road. it's down the road. Yes. Come to the school and learn, man. Because you see what we're doing? You're supposed to be doing this. Yes. You know why you're supposed to be doing this? Let me ask you a question. Do you know why we as a nation, we are at the bottom? Do you know? Okay, give me that thing to Tommy to verse 15. I'm going to show you why we as a people, we are at the bottom. We are struggling, we are poor. We are in the ghettos. We are poor. The reason why we are poor, the Bible is going to tell you why. Read it. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 15. Listen good. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. If What's going to happen? To observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day. If you don't follow it, what's going to happen? That all these curses, curses means italegiso. But today, no, 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 nobody's lawyering you, my brother. You're just breaking the laws of God. Yeah, but the thing is, black people believe in that. You know why? No, it's because we broke the law. No. The reason why you say about loyal is because you don't know that Ungulukuluk shine in Kalegis. No, Ungulukuluk shine in Kalegis. No, but you don't believe. You are running. But you are. Now, my brother, you've been standing here the whole time. I'm giving you the answer to why Tina Ungulukulu should take us off. And listen, listen. But Tina City, no, that's loyal. No, Ungulukulu should shine in Kalegis. Yes. Yes. Right. If you hammer that, if you if you hammer that, if you hammer that, if you hammer that, okay. If I hammer that, if I hammer that, if you move away, yes. But you, Daniel, you go look close up. You go look so shiny, no. How? You go look look punch, Daniel. How does he punish you? Yes, how does he punish you? Yes. You know, it happens with men. Who is in the bed? Hold that. Yes. Who is in the bed? Man is in the bed. Who is in the bed? 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 Who is we don't cause this. We are not going to do We are We 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 to We Sharp, right. Okay, that's good. I'm glad you say that. So when you say you repent, what do you use to teach you what is the right way to repent? What do you use? To teach you this is how you repent. No, no. No, no, not to you anymore. No, Baba. Listen, listen. The way for you to make rain, you must listen to Umteto. Umteto Uti. Maupuza. Unga puza lo hama lingili. That's the law. So if you want to repent, you stop doing it. You drink in your house. That's the law. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Skulma nga repentance, Anish. I'm giving a simple example. Ukulma nga repent, Anish. Oh, if you are repent. If you want to change, you find when the saw, 
Hayo kuchu wa inu sichia lukuchu mweza Na ungu lukul fana chere the way to do it Topic 4, verse 15 Wait, wait No, I'm gonna give you the answer Now I'm gonna have a simple example Because lale, wait, wait, wait Wait, but the way you come to him You don't come to him without using his book His book tells you how to change Now I'm gonna show you how to do it Really, topic 4, 15 Yeah, but listen, this is how you know him Listen good, listen good the book of Torah, chapter 4, verse 15. Listen. Go ahead. Do that to no man which thou hate. Go ahead. Drink not wine to make thee drunk. I did don't drink wine to get drunk. But my... Oh, wait, wait. Go ahead. Neither let drunkenness go with thee in thy church. At Maupuza, don't be going around with petty boys and humble as that day. God don't say don't drink. He says when you drink, sit down drink in your house. Don't be tra traveling around with petty boys and you're going to be hit by cars. The Lord says, don't do that. God don't say he doesn't drink. He didn't say don't drink. He says, but when you drink, challenge in in order, be dignified, sit in the house, drink properly. It's very simple. It's very simple in order. So are you going to change it? I'm going to ask it. Yes. Oh, you must return, man. Down the road, man. Yes, you must just go down the road. You go down, we have a school day. Come in late. Hallelujah. This is your wine. I wonder what we're doing, Baba. We're doing it for our nation. We don't get paid for this. We're not doing it to get paid. We have jobs. This is the job that every Israelite man, every black man, but go if, they, if you want to rule the nations, you must teach this Bible that your people may be delivered. If you don't do it, you'll continue being a slave. It will never change. Yeah. That's why we do this, man. We do this because we love our people. That's why God says every black man must pick up this Bible, go to the street corners, and teach their people the laws of God. That's the job. That's it. No problem, man. I'm a child. i fly or hang man. Learn more. Yeah, go on, Yes. He can take your numbers also. Thank you. He can take your numbers. Give your numbers, man. Ngulungul is looking for soldiers, man. To teach their Bible. To wake up their people. That's why we're at the bottom right now. Because we don't want to what? Fight for our nation. This is what we're doing to fight our nation. You're not going to fight the nations with your guns. You pick up, put the knife down. Put the gun down, pick up this Bible and wake up your nation. That's what God wants. 